just check that padlock on the chain to make sure it's real. Okay. And can you put that loop over my head? I ask you to pick up the chain there, okay? And I'm going to put some tension on the chain, so if you want to walk back a little bit, okay? And this is the tension that I want you to put on the chain when you're wrapping me up, okay? I'm going to release it now, because this is probably the most dangerous part of this stuff, because this chain could get wrapped around my neck. If that happens, I'm just going to ask you to release it, Toby, or I'm going to come into the audience and ask one of you to release it on my behalf, because I'm sure you don't want to see a public execution here on the banks of the Thames. Maybe you do, by the look of your faces. I don't think that's 50-50 there, but there you go. The other thing that could happen is, uh, Toby, you're pulling the change tight, I could start to wobble and fall. If I fall in towards you, it is not an illusion, catch me, because otherwise, because I can't get my arm out, I head up the concrete, and the cleaners don't like cleaning up all the blood, it's not good for Okay, so let's do this. Okay, I'll put some chain tension on. Yeah, what I'll do is I'll help you with the first bucket. So if you stay there, that's okay. Because what I'm going to do is I'm going to go under an elbow and ask you to put it up onto my shoulder. Okay, and just release a little bit of the chain. And if you want to move towards the box um, a little bit, that's good. Because now I'm going to go the other way. Okay, so I'm going to go under an elbow and around. Now, and if you stay there, no, that's fine. And if you stay there, and walk right around with me. Okay, that's brilliant. Excellent. Pulling nice and tight. Okay, and a second time as well. Yeah, yeah. Okay. okay, that's brilliant. And if you release a little bit of the chain now. Okay, that's good. Because now we're going to go through the legs. Enjoy. Is that your thing? Good. <laughs> okay, so what we'll do is I will, I'll help you again. Okay, so if you lower the chain a little bit from the floor, because I'm getting a bit old and I'm not a ballerina, okay, I'm going to hop over. Okay, so I'm going to hop over and if you pull the chain tight. Sure. Yeah. Absolutely positive. <laughs> well, I'm having second thoughts with you, Toby. Okay, okay, that's fine. And bring the chain up over my left shoulder. Okay. That's it. Okay, that's brilliant. Okay, excellent. That's it. And if you lower the chain to the floor again, um, what I will do is we'll go through the other leg. So I'm going to hop over. Okay, and if you pull the chain off, tight, that's it. And then bring the chain up onto my forearm. Yeah. Yeah, it's still too loose. Yeah, okay. It is one of the important things of keeping the chain nice and tight. Okay. Yeah, I can feel them. Okay, and then walk around me. That's it. And actually, if you can then grab the padlock, if you come to the side of me, to come to the side of me because what I'd like you to do is the audience to see the padlock on my forearm. Just yeah. put it in there and join the chain that you're holding. Okay. Um, no, uh, if you do it on this left forehand, well, yeah, that's fine. there'll be a loose bit of chain at the end. But just so everybody can see it. Just changing it to one other bit of chain. Chain, yeah. 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 Okay. And to you. Yeah, take the key out. Take the key out. And if you put the key down by the box. Okay, Toby, if you stand there. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. yeah. actually I really appreciate what Toby has done this afternoon. He's come out and he's helped me um, and put me in the straight jacket and chain. And I think you as an audience probably appreciate what Toby has done because it's avoided me actually embarrassing everybody else. So what I'd like you to do in a moment is give Toby a big round of applause. But this is street theatre, it's live, it's loud, it's not like watching go. And you've got to be polite applause. So let's all together give it up for 
Toby. Give it up for Toby. Thank you very much, Toby. Excellent. Excellent. Yeah, yeah, thank you. Okay, so I'm now in the 10 metres of chain and the straight jacket. Um, but I've got a confession to start with. I'm not a street performer. I actually work in an office. <laughs> well, I used to work in an office because I had a dream that actually life and work could be a lot more fun than actually sitting down behind a computer screen. So I decided that I would come out here and try and entertain people, make them smile and make them laugh. Um, so, I term this not a straitjacket and chain escape, but it is my escape from office life. So, uh, what we're going to do, we're going to start this off now and we're going to see whether I can or I cannot get out. Who knows? Who knows? So, what I'd like you to do is actually to start this off with a countdown. So, if I start you off with 10, then you carry on from there. So, let's do it. Let's do it together. Uh, so, 10, 9, 8, eight Seven, nice and loud. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, let's see what we can do. And I'll explain what I'm trying to do so you can see this escape because it's all about trying to release some of the tension in the chains. I think you've done a good job, Toby. I think you might have done too good a job. Okay, so you can start to see one of the chains come off the shoulder but now I'm working to get a bit of tension off the ones on the arm and actually the more you jump up and down that tension starts to ease off and once you've got a little bit of tension loose it becomes easier to actually release them so you can start to see them fall off Okay, and one of the things with this is to try and make sure that there's enough movement in the arms. The arms start to come undone. And actually they come through the loop, which makes this a slightly un unusual straight jacket to escape from. So that then comes off. Now I'll just try and put that back on. Can you hear me again? Okay, and then hopefully the rest of the chains will come off the body and the crutch strap that Toby didn't hold back on will come off. And finally, could you just take my microphone off while we do the last bit because it will fall off? Okay. Excellent. Great jacket should come off over the head. Okay, so that is my office escape, strip jacket, and chain. Yeah, so thank you, I appreciate you watching my escape. Yeah, well, my name's Dave Richards. 
Uh, I actually am an accountant, but um, at the weekends I come out and try and entertain the people in London uh, doing a street show, which is a mixture of using animal traps and a straight jacket um, and chain escape. And it's actually something that I've found that's really great fun. It's nice to see um, people with their smile, smile on their face and actually um, people from all over the world coming in here and joining in. Uh, the fun as well. So I, I really enjoy it and it's a huge um, change from my day job um, sitting in an office um, and it's been great fun. Have you got any footage up on YouTube? Have you got a no. channel or anything? No. Yeah, no, 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 not at the moment. So, um, you know, I, I'd really like to start oh, that yes. and just um, advertise the show and other things that 